Mr. President, you have been very bullish on the promise of convalescent plasma yeah. to treat coronavirus. The FDA appeared to be on the brink of issuing an emergency use authorization for convalescent plasma, but after hearing from top officials at the NIH that there wasn't enough evidence to go ahead with that, the FDA has put that on pause. Your reaction to that, and do you believe that convalescent plasma should be in the arsenal of treatments for Well, I hear great things about it, John. That's all I can tell you. And uh, it could be a political decision because you have a lot of people over there that don't want to rush things because they want to they want to do it after November 3rd. And you've heard that one before. But I've heard fantastic things about convalescent plasma. And uh, I've heard numbers way over 50 percent uh, success. And people are dying and we should have it approved if it's good. And I'm hearing it's good. I heard from people at the FDA that it's good. So we'll see. I'm going to check that right after this conference. My understanding that the White House will encourage the NIH and the FDA to get this out there as quickly well, as possible? Well, the numbers are as good as I'm hearing. I mean, I'm hearing over 50 percent, and that's very good. And we've approved certain things are at 31 percent, and that's OK, too. That's not bad. And it's really had a tremendous impact. Uh, but, uh, no, I, I have uh, — you're telling me something right now that surprises me, but we'll check it out right after this. Concerned about a delay? I don't want delays. I don't want people dying.